Welcome to the next episode of the new Newcrest and it is Sunday morning and we will be spending this Sunday at the Bartley Yurt. And we are here at the Yurt and it's Sunday morning. Everyone had to go to bed. The boys, or at least Damien, was out late, really late last night. So everybody's kind of sleeping in. Grandpa's uh, getting up. It's 9.40 in the morning. I'd say they slept in. Grandpa, go to the bathroom. It's almost noon here. The boys are kind of vying for the bathroom. I think we got that straightened out. Grandpa's out here taking care of the garden. That's not looking too good, but it is winter time. Um, I got Houston up and shaved. He's ready for uh, this Sunday. So it's it's Sunday midday. It's time to get this party started. Okay. And there is Damien. Damien, can you uh, shower, dude? You look like you stink. No? Oh, you were just tooting. Damien. Come here, ask her to come in. Does he know her? Are people going to come in? Come here. You know him, he's your bud. Okay, there's Brad. You both know Brad. And some of the kids have shown up for this get-together at the Bartley house. And let's see how they interact. We're building a snow pal. Some are just walking around. It's interesting. What is it about the Bennetts and the McDonald's that always end up, you know? I know they are the typical couple, aren't they? And here they are just kind of heading it off all on their own. It's pretty cute. We're from the same side of the tracks. Our parents just expect us to date. You know? Yeah. He's feeling confident. I think that he has no problem flirting with her, though. Let's see. Be bold. You're confident. Everybody hits on her anyways. Okay. I think Houston's going to make his move. Let's see. He's going to see if Sheila's a vegetarian. Once again, the Bennetts and the McDonald's are congregating. These Vu girls are uh, a little mysterious. My kids are hanging out inside. That's sweet. Do you want to talk to her? She's the one that does it with the teacher or something. There's some scandal about Sophia and the teachers. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody's good with the veggies. Of course, um, veggies are legal here. So it's okay. It's not a scandalous thing. But Just some kids experimenting. Though Sheila's uh, not taking it so well. She's pretty flirty too. She's getting up to talk to him. Houston's gonna 
make some moves on Sheila here. Sheila's a little bit dazed, but I think she's going to give him attention here. What's she freaking out about? Maybe you should look into her eyes. Better eye contact might help you. Look, he gave her his number. She seems to kind of be staring at him blindly. A lot of the kids are leaving. She is like, what? All right, you do it too. You do it too. You don't want her to feel like you're not cool. Right? You just talk to her. You got this, buddy. Be bold. If Grandpa weren't sitting here dancing in front of us, this might go better. The trick was to do that with her, buddy. Alright, can you go talk to her? No, 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 no. You need to go talk to her. Don't give up. Don't give up, okay? Are you boring her? <laughs> Ask her about messing around. Maybe you are boring her. Maybe you just don't interest her. Try it. Okay, sure. Okay. Come on. Try it. Is she liking it? Why is dad getting in on the conversation here? And he's got Sheila Bennett in the yard here in like the palm of his hands. Let the kids focus on each other. And there it goes. Oh, oh yes, romance is in the air. <laughs> you little devil, Sheila Bennett. Oh. Let's see what's going to happen with these two. He's putting the moves on. Things are going well, Sheila Bennett. What do you think about that, huh? Come on, Sheila Bennett. You know you like being here with the boys on the yurt. What do you think about that? We grow the best vegetables here. <laughs> yeah, you're all right, buddy. You know, it's Sunday, it's 10 o'clock. You probably should send her home. So we're out here with Houston Bartley and Sheila Bennett. And this episode's going to end here. Thank you so much for spending this Sunday at the Bartley Yurt. It's been a very, very lovely time. Wouldn't you say? I really didn't expect this, but sometimes... Things just happen. <laughs>